Hey there everybody, it's Mike Delisio with another Dice Tower Daily Unboxing. Today we're going to be taking a look at the newest faction for Unmatched, I guess it's a couple of them here, Little Red Riding Hood versus Beowulf. The Unmatched series of games have been very, very popular. It's a tactical battle game and you can put different uh, units against each other. In this case we have two, so this is a a standalone game, you can just play Little Red versus Beowulf on the included map, but you can also incorporate this into other unmatched series. So you can use the Cobble and Fog uh, system and have Invisible Man playing against Beowulf, or you can, there's just any number of different characters. There's a Jurassic Park set, so you can have Raptors going against Little Red Riding Hood. It's one of those types of games that are very modular. You can put them together. It's a system. All right. So this, well, speaking of, as if I on cue, the unmatched system. Okay. A miniatures dueling game feeding fighters, featuring fighters of all kinds. Okay. And they all have their own unique decks and they play uh, in a distinct way, but they all kind of work through this system. All right. So we'll just flip through the book relatively quickly. There's a lot of uh, information and videos out there about Unmatched as a series, but what we're going to just really be doing is looking quickly at the decks for both of these characters, looking at the map, and uh, taking a quick look at the minis as well, just to get a feel. So here's something that I want to kind of focus on, just because this is going to be unique to this set. So we've got special rules for this set. Little Red Riding Hood, it looks like she's got a something called the basket, the top card of her Discard pile is her basket and contains whatever symbols in the banner of the top card. So that's interesting. That's something new. So it looks like there are some cards that will affect that basket card. Beowulf looks like he's got a uh, mechanic called Rage. Three tokens to track his current Rage. He starts with one. He can have a maximum of three. All right. And uh, when he takes damage, uh, regardless of where he takes it or where it comes from, he gains a Rage. And it looks like maybe there are cards that will trigger based on that rage. It looks like we also have doors on this game board, which is something new. Uh, at the beginning of the game, place the door tokens to the side. A fighter may open or close a door only as part of a maneuver action, but not as part of other movement effects. Okay, there we go. So, some unique elements to this particular set. Player dials, here are our doors. Here are the rage tokens for Beowulf. Okay, let's take a look at the map here. All right, so this is the standard map here. Let me just do this flat, okay? This is the standard version of the map, which has a system so that you can see what basically are in uh, line of sight or range based upon the pattern on those. This is basically the same map, just slightly different aesthetically, okay? And so it really just is gonna depend on perhaps usability concerns or aesthetic preferences, all right? But it's the same map on both sides, just slightly different um, elements to it, all right? So let's take a look here. You get a sense of the, these all have washes on them to let the kind of details pop a little bit. We've got a couple of, looks like some sidekick tokens here. All right. Oftentimes these characters will have sidekicks that can be triggered through the use of cards and moving around. All right. So here's Little Red and here's Beowulf. All right. And you can kind of see these slot in to those little areas. All right. Always some nice trays and storage systems in these sets. So let's take a look at Beowulf cards. So Beowulf being the main character and Wiglaf being the sidekick. They're both melee characters and it talks about rage there and it gives you just a little player aid card. All right, so let's look just a quick look at Beowulf's cards. Some of the incredible art that is seen throughout this series. Uh, it's a very distinctive and in my Opinion, very well done. So you can see different types of cards here, melee cards, defense cards, 
kind of immediate cards. Okay. All right. And then we also have the little reds card. Let's take a look at those. They're being a little more stubborn. There we go. All right, so Little Red is the main character and it's a melee attack. The Huntsman is her sidekick and the Huntsman is ranged, okay? There's Little Red's basket. What big ears you have. What big eyes you have. What a terrible big mouth you have. That's great. So a nice thematic touches there, of course, a grim tale. What's that in my basket? All right. Well, I think that gives us a pretty good idea of what we're going to find inside the box of Unmatched Little Red Riding Hood versus Beowulf. Thank you for watching another Dice Tower Daily Unboxing.